Hello, and welcome back to the Monoprice Studio. My name is Dimitri, and today let's learn a little bit about 70 volt technology and if it's right for you. If you've ever considered adding background music to your home or business, you owe it to yourself to consider the advantages of a 70 volt system. 70 volt systems employ something called constant voltage technology, which in this case is 70 volts. 70 volt technology allows you to easily connect many speakers to one amplifier using a single speaker wire, making installation much easier. Since 70 volt systems don't operate in a traditional stereo configuration that normally requires wiring speakers in pairs, so you can connect 5, 10, or even 50 speakers in parallel to a single amplifier, providing you match the speaker's power requirements to the proper size amplifier, which we will discuss. For example, if you're installing speakers into a restaurant with high ceilings, you may want to use pendant style speakers that allow you to easily adjust the height and therefore the coverage area with it allowing you to use less speakers than wall or ceiling mounted speakers. If this was an office building or school with T-bar ceilings and you just require basic audio for announcements, you may be able to use an acoustic tile speaker and do the job. In this situation, you may be able to use fewer speakers than if it was a retail store where you need background music to create a favorable shopping environment. So now that you have an idea of how many speakers you need, you also need to consider how loud it needs to play. Every 70 volt speaker has a built-in transformer that allows it to function with a constant voltage amplifier. And almost all of these transformers have multiple wattage taps that ultimately determine how loud it can play. Now this may sound a little complicated, but ultimately it's a pretty easy system as I'll explain. Let's say you have a basic six inch ceiling speaker with 2.5 watt, five watt, and 10 watt taps. If you're installing this speaker into a quiet building that needed only soft background music, you would likely use the 2.5 watt taps as the volume will never need to get too, too loud. If you're installing these same speakers into a bar or similar place with a louder atmosphere, you need to use higher wattage taps. Now let's say this is a sports bar and you would be playing audio from a sporting event or you're piping music from a live band into the patio or other part of the venue. You would need even higher volume, so you would need to ratchet up to the highest wattage tap. Remember, you can always turn volume down, but if you don't have enough speakers or enough volume, you can't turn it up. Now that you've determined how many speakers you'll need and how loud it, they'll need to play, you can finally start choosing an amplifier. And this is the easy part. Simply add up the wattage taps on all the speakers you're using, and this is the total amount of power in watts that the system will require. I know that I said this is the easy part, but I do need to throw in a tiny caveat. While the numbers we added up e earlier equal the amount of power they will draw, we need to account for something called insertion loss which is basically it's a very technical way of saying that the amplifier's power doesn't travel to the speaker at 100% efficiency. In truth, there are a lot of little vampiric drains on the power. And no, I don't mean little tiny vampires, but actually little inefficiencies at the transformer, the wiring, etc. That, as a rule, accounts for about 20% loss. So basically, what we're saying is that you need to choose an amplifier with at least 20% more power than the wattage tap you added up. If you needed 100 watts, choose a minimum 120 watt amplifier. Of course, there are other things to consider in your amplifier choice, such as features and etc. but this should take the mystery out of how to determine your basic needs for an amp. Now that we've explained 70 volt technology and its uses, what are your thoughts on the system? The technology involved is extremely universal and easy to use, all the way from speaker wiring to choosing the correct amp and setting up the audio in specific locations or settings. Adding background music or a PA system doesn't need to be a complicated ordeal, and 70 volt technology makes it truly easy. If you think I missed any information or you have any other tips for your users who are still deciding on their system, leave a comment down below. And as always, thank you and have a great rest of your day.